There's a lot of 4-in-1 ESCs to choose from these days, and they come in all shapes and sizes and specs. And this HAKRC HK3220 has just arrived on the scene, and it stands out from the rest for a very good reason. This is a 60 amp BL Heli 32 4-in-1 ESC, which is all fairly standard, until you realise this is on a 20 by 20 footprint. And if you're looking for a 4-in-1 ESC board with lots of grunt, particularly for racing that's small and light, this may well be for you. So let's take a closer look. Hello and welcome to the Whirly Black channel. As you can see, this is a 20 by 20 mounting pattern. There we go. And although the board itself is slightly bigger, it's I think 34 by 34 by 42, if you include the power tabs. But even so, to find a 60 amp ESC with a burst current rating of 70 amps on a small board like this is pretty unusual. And HAKRC partially put this compact design down to using an eight layer, two ounce copper PCB design that means it can handle the higher currents and has got much better heat dissipation. And this board, as you can see, is absolutely littered with these 50 volt Murata capacitors on both sides. And the quality looks to be extremely good. And this only weighs, well, let's have a quick look. Turned on. Eleven grams. And this PCB, it's very, very quality. Let's have a look. That is two mil essentially. And it's got a current sensor down here. Um, but there's no onboard back. But to be honest, most flight controller boards these days have got backs to spare. And this uses an AT32F421F4 chip running at up to 120 megahertz, which is an improvement on the F3 chips they used on previous boards. And this supports all the usual multi-shot and D-shot ESC protocols. And it comes flashed with BL Heli 32 version 32.9. And although I haven't had a chance to try it yet, because this is hot off the production line, HAKRC claimed this has got a much smoother throttle linearity and a faster response. And I think I know what build I'm going to be using this in, so I'll keep you posted on that. Now, in the box, you get all the usual bits and pieces. There's some soft mount gummies, a flight connector, board interconnect lead, an XT60, and a cable. And you get this Rubicon 470 microfarad 35 volt filter capacitor. The price on this is £52, and that's around $63. So it's not the cheapest ESC, but remember, it is a 60 amp quality 4 in 1 ESC. I don't see this being used on cine whoops or smaller quads, but if you want an ESC for an all out light waste and super fast racer, this is definitely worth a look. Now, this only seems to be available from Banggood at the moment. It's not even available on the HAKRC website, but I'm sure it'll start appearing on other supply sites very soon. And I've left a link in the video description so you can check out the latest prices and availability. And if you want to keep up to date with my builds and tech and anything else in the world of Whirly Bloke, yeah, you should probably subscribe and turn on the notification bell. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.